Parkinson's disease affects thousands of Americans each year, whether directly or because of someone in your family. This weekend, the American Parkinson's Disease Association Connecticut chapter is raising awareness and how you can help. Here with the details are Dr. Maria Mora de Casillas, who is a movement disorders neurologist at the Chase Family Movement Disorder Center, along with Solomon Yee, who is a Medtronic Deep Brain Stimulation representative. It's great to have you both with us. Thank you. All right, Parkinson's disease, we were just saying how thousands of Americans are affected, but it is yes. something that people associate with, with older folks, but truly it can affect people of all ages. Yes, indeed. Uh, Parkinson's disease is a lifelong progressive neurological disorder in which there is a gradual loss of a chemical in the brain called dopamine, which leads to a gradual deterioration on the patient's ability to move and to walk. Uh, it, it affects, there is one million Americans living with mm -hmm. Parkinson's disease today and approximately 10 million people worldwide. And although it is more frequently diagnosed after the age of 65, it does affect younger people, uh, being 10% of the patients that we see younger than 50. So it affects people at all stages of their life. Very good. We'll talk about the symptoms in a, in a sec, yes. but uh, Salma, let's talk about this optimism walk that's happening this weekend. Yeah, so uh, the APDA is a nationwide uh, support uh, resource for people with Parkinson's disease, and every state has the optimism walk, and Connecticut has two, and the uh, second one is in uh, a Sherwood Island uh, tomorrow, actually. Mm -hmm. So registration is closed online, but you're more than welcome to just show up, and we'll get you registered. Um, it's going to be about a mile walk, uh, lots of music, food, uh, a lot of vendors there to, for education on Parkinson's disease, and it's going to be a lot of fun, but basically the funds are going to go for, to, to help support those for, with Parkinson's, um, find a cure, and just, or the, the goal is to have a, a fun day but also help people at the same time. Absolutely, yeah. and of course, at the, at the disorder center where you are, doctor, uh, you are helping a lot of folks with this. Uh, research, extremely important. Definitely, and um, the, all the work that the APDA do, does for patients uh, in, in the country, uh, not only in research, but also improving their quality of lives and helping patients. Actually, um, I wanted to share with your audience that uh, we have been appointed, the, the Chase Family Movement Disorder Center was appointed by the APDA as an information and referral center. On one, one of 22 centers in the country which have been recognized. Congratulations. And it is an amazing support for, for patients living with Parkinson's disease, their families, caregivers, and the community in general. We have, we offer several services, including a helpline, counseling and guidance, uh, education. And I want to invite the viewers to either call the helpline or just stop by and visit us in person to see who we are, what we do, and how we can help. Right, the center is so important, right, Solomon, for, for folks, and that's why money is so, the research money is so needed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the ultimate goal is to, to find a cure okay. for Parkinson's mm -hmm. disease, uh, but uh, the, the money, they, it helps people like, for, uh, like this center or also support groups. Um, exercise programs, mm -hmm. transportation, there's uh, so many things that money can uh, go towards. Uh, and again, that walks tomorrow at uh, uh, Sherwood Island, and it's from 10 to 12, and we just hope we get a good turnout. We want to share the referral center's phone number as well. Yes, please. Thank you. And the, the APDA Information and Referral Center, you can call 860-734-6393. And uh, folks who call that number will get any information they need about Parkinson's? Uh, definitely about Parkinson's disease, uh, services in the community, educational resources, counseling guidance, and many other. That's wonderful. Yes. Thank you both, and uh, I'm sure it'll be a great weekend for your walk you. as well. There, at least the weather is co cooperating. Yes, yes. I hope <laughs> Thank so, you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're so welcome. Coming up, we're